Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to make cheddar stuffed sriracha pretzel bites. These are basically spicy soft pretzels stuffed with cheddar cheese. Seriously, you can't go wrong. These are amazingly delicious and I have a hard time eating just one. As soon as I start eating, I can't stop and I eat like 10. So, so good. We're gonna start by making our dough in a stand mixer. Pretzel dough is super easy to make. Start with one and three quarters of a cup of water, a tablespoon of instant yeast, which means you don't have to let it sit, a quarter cup of brown sugar, two tablespoons of sriracha sauce, and then four cups of flour. Just make sure you're using all-purpose flour and not self-rising or any of that stuff. Next, we just mix it together until a dough ball forms. See how the dough is pulling away from the sides? That's exactly what we're looking for. If you find that your dough is sticking, try adding in more flour about a quarter cup at a time until you get a nice solid dough that doesn't stick to your hands. We're gonna transfer this to a lightly greased bowl where it's gonna rest for about 20 minutes. Now, if you don't have a stand mixer, don't fret. You can still make this recipe. You'll simply do it by hand. Start by mixing things together with a spoon and when that gets too hard, use your hands. It'll just require a little bit of finger muscles. While this is resting, we're gonna get everything else ready to go. You'll need some cheddar cheese that's been cut into cubes. We're gonna stuff this in the middle of our dough. Then you're gonna also need a quarter cup of melted butter. To that, I'm gonna add in two tablespoons of sriracha sauce and stir that in. We're gonna brush this over the pretzel bites once they're cooked. You'll need a pot of boiling water. This one isn't quite to a boil yet, but I'm gonna add in two tablespoons of baking soda and let that finish coming to a boil. And last, you'll need a lightly greased baking sheet ready to go. Now it's time to put our pretzels together. Break off walnut-sized pieces of dough, take about the size of a walnut, grab a piece of cheddar, put it in the middle, pinch it together, roll it up, and there you go. Working a few at a time, place the stuffed pretzels into the baking soda water let them boil for about one minute and then use a slatted spoon to remove them from the water and place them onto the prepared baking sheet. Once you have a tray of 12, bake them in a 500 degree oven for about five minutes. Once they're golden brown, remove them from the oven and brush the tops with some of this sriracha butter. Just brush it on. You have a nice buttery, spicy coating to these beautiful pretzels. These are best when served warm, so you have all that ooey gooey cheese inside. But you can always reheat them in the microwave later for about 10 seconds. Thanks for watching. You can find the full written recipe in the video description. Be sure to subscribe and check out the rest of my channel where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.